Boxes of kid-friendly food, macaroni and cheese, fruit bars, Capri Suns and veggies made their way into dozens of backpacks at the Catholic Charities headquarters. An assembly line of sorts run by volunteers who all have the same goal in mind. I mean, it's just so nice to know that somebody's not going to be hungry this weekend. 22, Each week, every one of these backpacks is 15. filled, counted, and loaded strategically into a truck. They're then delivered to students at each participating school, just in time for the weekend. The first stop this week, Howard Bishop Middle School. While organizers say the number definitely fluctuates, this week there's 160 of these backpacks on their way to 16 different Alachua County schools. Organizer Kathy Ann Solomon says the weekend backpack program fills a void. Many of the students who receive a backpack eat breakfast, lunch and dinner at school for free, but that leaves them with long and hungry weekends. In the program, there are some kids that we deem homeless. And when we say homeless, it's not that they're living on the streets or in a car, but they're moving from the aunt's house to grandma's house. With help from the organization, each of these kids can pull a backpack of food they could easily prepare themselves anywhere they go. You know, you think about things everywhere else, but I had no idea that it was that much of a problem here. In its fifth year, the team at Catholic Charities says they're always looking for volunteers to help keep the program going strong. In Alachua County, I'm Angie Andrews, CBS 4 News.